Many scientists over the years have done a lot of research, and I believe that waking up early is very annoying. However, it's very beneficial, and it'll make your day a lot more productive. And here's the science behind it. Welcome back to the channel, guys. If you're new or you're a returner, make sure to leave a like if you guys end up waking up early. If you don't wake up early, leave a comment and let me know why. Me personally, I like to sleep in. I enjoy my mornings. However, after this video, I may consider do waking up early let's get into it first up i think the reason a lot of people like to wake up early is you'll feel like you're better than other people whoa this wasn't supposed to be one of those self-help tips i guess i should say to speak from the pedestal so this is why this is my first point confidence matters building skills and habits that make you feel better about yourself makes your life better in general on top of that human beings are wired to compare ourselves to others you do it, and I do it constantly. There's no denying that. So instead of pretending like we don't try to stay stuck in the negative cycles of comparison, why not find ways to feel like yourself is better than other people? Not instinctively, but behaviorally. Than other people. And what I mean by this is you're going to feel a lot better. When you're up at the crack of dawn working on your side business, exercising, or planning your day, you feel like you have a head start on the rest of the world. I mean, give it a try sometimes. Me personally, whenever I'm getting up at 6 or 7 or even earlier than that to work, and nobody's up around me, I just feel a lot better. Like, I literally have gotten a jump start on them. And if you think about it, if you get up every day of the week at 6 a.m. or earlier, you're literally going to guarantee yourself a full extra day just depending on how much you work. So it's like you're working 8 days a week instead of 7 days a week, and you have that much of a head step on your competition. Once the normal time people, however, wake up, it rolls around, you feel like you've already done so much before they're even in their morning shower. Next up we have, you'll stop doing this so much. Do you ever find yourself up late at night? Me? Yes. Do you ever find yourself eating late at night? Me? Definitely yes. Are you not getting enough sleep? Yes. I mean, if I feel like I'm targeting myself and also you guys, but if you answered yes to any of these, once the biggest benefits of waking up early is the ability to go to sleep early. And I don't mean like it's 6 p.m. or 7 p.m., but I mean at a reasonable time like 9.30, 10 p.m., 11 p.m., even 12 a.m. If you wake up at 5 a.m. and you're productive through the day, you're more, you're more likely to be tired at the end of the night, making it easier to sleep. This creates a better sleep cycle, and sleep is important for your health. Don't listen to all the gurus who tell you to skip your shut-eye and literally get two to three hours of sleep. Shorter yet healthier productive time periods are better than long but tired ones. I completely agree. For example, if you've ever felt tired during the middle of the day around 4 or 5 and you want to take a nap and you probably could, well then you're doing it wrong. You want to make sure you're energetic until that 8 o'clock, 9 o'clock period at night until where you just can't go any further. This ensures that you're going to be getting the most out of your days but also getting a productive work schedule in as well. Lastly, we have you'll appreciate it much more. If any of you guys have kids, you understand definitely the hustle and bustle of getting them everywhere during the day. The busy schedule, your life becomes that much more hectic. It's crazy. However, there are morning routines that people have with kids that they practice religiously. Part of it involves 20 minutes of meditation. You're not going to write a big benefit of meditation pause, but however, having 20 minutes per day where you feel like the world isn't spinning at 10 million hours per hour makes a huge impact on your sanity. I mean, to be honest, a lot of us, especially if you have someone to take care of or pets, kids, whatever the case may be, you need that quiet time. You need that downtime where it's just you and your thoughts. If you're an adult with kids, especially young ones, you live in the eye of a hurricane. Pile your job, errands, and the other minute that you have to deal with. It's enough to drive you nuts. You don't have to develop a meditation practice. In fact, you don't even have to do it, but you can at least get a little time to enjoy yourself with a little silence. Maybe it's reading a book. Maybe it's taking a short nap. Who knows? But I'll tell you guys this. If you take the time out of your day to treat yourself to a nice quiet period of time, your body is going to be thanking you for it later. Sleep is very beneficial. Getting it a lot is very good. However, going to sleep early, as we learned in today's video, is crucial. I hope you guys take a lot away from this video. I'm signing off. I will see you guys in the next upload.